it originates from the big your know, big timber trade over in America and Canada where the lads uh, would strip all the branches off top the tree off and use that tree as a as a pulling anchor point so the winches the the horses and the steam engines would pull the timber using this high high vantage point to be able to get all the timber into one landing area where it could then be moved by train or or however else they they required to move it but obviously that came from a from a, a trade where you'd get your climber in to strip those trees and there's always a competitive edge in in every, every industry isn't there so that's where it originates from really um we've just taken it to the next level three two one go come back oh, look at that super smooth face there couldn't run in a straight line that fast. Well done, Matt. Come on. Fantastic air by Matt. Look at that. It's basically a championship to decide who can climb up an 80 foot timber pole in the fastest time possible. It's as simple as that, really. Three, two, one, go. Wow, that's it. It's a positive strike. Really going for a bit of set by Bess. And the set by Bess. Come on, it's really close. Oh, <laughs> It's pretty tough, you know, you get to the top and it's a bit of a relief to be fair, but when you're doing it in 10 seconds, it's just a, it's just a, a big burst of energy to, to get yourself there. And then uh, once you're there, you're just absolutely knackered and it, it's hard work, it really is hard work. It's pretty bizarre, you know, when I first got into it, I thought, why do you want to climb up a pole? But then when I actually tried it, I thought it's really good fun, you know. We have a good laugh, all, all the climbers are really, really good, good people, you know, we're well into the sport and uh, we all get on really well. Yeah, it's just good sport. I mean, everybody's got to have a hobby. These boys, they uh, they've got a good hobby, and they get paid for it as well as a professional sport. Both gone in there.